Today I want to use the Fabled Skyburner's Oath plus Lion Rampant combo. These exotic boots allow me to fire from the hip accurately while activating my lift, in this case, high lift. And combining that with the Skyburner's Oath, this is a special scout rifle, meaning that if you fire from the hip, it shoots explosive seeking slugs, so it tracks them. It has the possibility of hitting people around walls, around cover, Enjoy yourself, but God. in my experience, it's just not very consistent. Sometimes it completely obliterates somebody in very few shots, and other times I'm seemingly shooting an entire mag into somebody, and it's not killing them. What gives? Okay, we're already doing this. See what happened? That was theirs. It, how many tethers? Two on my team, two on the enemy team. Got it. It's just not a very consistent setup. They might break this in a second, so I need to get out of here. That bubble is actually very, very clutch for getting away from so many tethers. No tag? Oh, lame. Oh, idea. Yes, it tagged him. Oh, no, it didn't tag him. That was my, uh... Thermite Grenade. That's the name of it. Dude, Hammers is so strong. Let's grab some Rocket Launcher. This is the Bazooka! Because it tracks people. I got you, teammate. So the reason I chose Mayhem is because in quick play, you just get shot out of the sky like a clay pigeon. The only way to make this setup really effective against people, you know, trying their damnedest to win farming tractor cannon is to play with a team. And what you want to do is use this Skyburner's Oath as a sort of flinch mechanism to hit them as they bait and switch around cover. Oh, direct impact. Disgusting. Can I have this? Only five minutes left. I cannot. If you want it, this battle is yours. Take it. That's Ooh, that's actually pretty good strafing like that. Nope. Out of here. Get out of the tether zone. I went to the tether zone. No, nope, never gonna sing again. Never gonna give you up. I did it again. Oh. Two. Make it three. Let's set up this angle. I get tethered, I die. That's actually fine. Because I can see third person and he can't. It wasn't exactly where I wanted to put it, but it was close. Oh shit. I need to use my shoulder charge to full effect so I can hip fire people from the sky. Or are they just gonna stay indoors all day? 
Indoors. I, I said I'd stop singing, but come on. SpongeBob reference, you gotta love it. Let's get the track and rocket, jump off the map. Oh shit, that's a goldie. Is he out yet? Three shots. Beautiful. Give me them rockets. Bait this power. How are they not already there? I definitely need to aim down sights just a little bit longer to uh, hit them with this tracking rocket. Ooh, that was sick! The flick and everything, and it tracked in the right place and went around the wall just to hit him with that explosive. Very, very nice. Dude, this rocket is sick. Shax is really excited about that. Beautiful. So yeah, while this setup is fun, nobody will let me use it in quick play. And then I go to Mayhem and it's suddenly amazing. I'm dead. Ooh, maybe not. I did it! Good. I can join the Quick Play Grand Finals Hall of Fame. I told you to fight, Dude, Sunbreaker's busted compared to other supers in this mood. I mean, Dawnblade's up there too. But like, Golden Gun, man, something needs to be done. Something needs to make Golden Gun slightly better. Because Hammer gets third person damage resistance proximity on the hammers to hit people around corners even if you miss and if you miss it detonates a second time with just as much power as the first on top of having access to titan skating on pc meanwhile dom blade flame jesus flies around the entire map throwing blades moves mach 10 has the advantage of phoenix dive to get his health back and slam people meanwhile the golden gun lasts a couple seconds Instant kill across the map, I get that. That's very, very strong. But when compared to the others, especially the third person capabilities, as you saw how I could stay alive in that mayhem match, it's just weaker. Golden Gun is weaker. I don't know what to say. Now, I will attempt this again in the future in uh, standard mode. Maybe next time, uh, maybe when mayhem is not the playlist of the week, I'll try this again. But in quick play right now, like I said, man, I am a clay pigeon. People just shoot me out of the sky, and it doesn't make for very good commentary. Because like I said earlier as well, this is sort of an RNG. Just I shoot it at people, sometimes they die, sometimes they don't. I don't feel like I have a lot of control over my engagements. I don't feel like my aim is winning me fights. And so I can't predictably, you know, call things ahead of time and follow through because it might not happen. Let's see, six of eight. Now I'm just gonna end this here. I'll see you guys in tomorrow. I had a uh, very, very long 4th of July. I'm kind of exhausted. I'll try to make some longer episodes in the future. Thanks for watching.